Greetings! We meet at last. You're looking extra squishy and loser-like today. The ox is in. The year of the peacock begins now! Hello everyone, my name is Soulmongry, and I'd like to welcome you back to more Kung Fu Panda! In this episode we are playing with Lord Shen, who is average at best in my opinion. He's pretty quick on his attacks. Some of his attacks really hurt him. Like that one right there, he cannot hit his opponent on the way up. And then he's an easy target to get knocked out by somebody that isn't directly underneath him. Other than that, he's pretty solid. Except for the fact that his special can be easily avoidable if you have a brain. But it is a cool special, and I cannot wait to show you guys it. And he is a peacock, as you guys know. So he has those big feathers, although you do not get to see them at all. None of his moves bring out the feathers in him. He does have a projectile attack as well, if I can land. Coming down with the spin. Alright, I gotta get out of there. Whoa! Oh, come on! Can't we just play nice, guys? Can't we just play nice? Peacocks don't bite. They might peck your eyes out, but you don't need those. I like that blade attack. I just like how it looks. It's not the best. I do have my awesome. I'm gonna bring it in. It's pretty cool. He's got the cannonballs. Just like in the movie. <laughs> I love it. He is obsessed with explosives. I'm surprised he hasn't blown himself up. Maybe he has a couple times. He's a cartoon, so he just makes that weird, wacky recovery. The one where he's all, like, drowsy and, like, all, like, singed and, like, and he sees stars. That's how cartoon life works, fellas. I was once a cartoon. I know. My favorite place to visit is actually Toontown. There I can hang out with Roger Rabbit and the boys, the weasels, and laugh it up. I love it. Yep, it's all rainbows up your butt in that area. Except for when they bring in the dip. Then we ask for Bob's help. R.I.P. Bob Hoskins. You are awesome. But anyways, Shen's pretty cool. I'm gonna see if I can get his projectiles. Oh. If you charge it up, he will shoot four, I believe. Otherwise, you can just rapidly press him. If I can stop dying here, I could demonstrate it. Actually, let me beat these guys real quick. Because this is always a risky round. Let me grab the pig. Eh. Alright, now we can use our projectiles. Oh, I threw it into the pig. Here we go. Oh, had a good opportunity. Golden peacock! That'd be worth a whole bunch. I wonder if he would spout out golden eggs like the golden goose. That'd be pretty cool. And Shen could even expand his empire more. And buy more wolf guards. Boom. Bringing down the spear. And using the old rear. Oh yeah. Nice. So this should do it. If I can beat him. I'm going to bring in the awesome. Two times in a round. Real nice. Taste the cannonballs. Taste the firepower. Yes. Explosives are better than kung fu. <laughs> so I didn't even knock him out there. I feel like if you're playing other real people and you're on a bigger stage, like with three platforms, you can probably avoid that. Hey guys, I got this thing. Oh, he's got one more thing left? Oh no. I might be in trouble here. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I only have one continue because my controller died earlier when I was playing this. And I was on that crown level. And <laughs> they beat me in the crown level. And then I got new batteries. And those ones died on the same level. So I lost on that level twice. So I'm running out of continues here. That's alright. Like I said in the beginning, it's the day of the peacock. It's Tuesday, right? Oh no, wait. It's Saturday. Oh no, it's the day of the wolf and the ox. What are the chances of that happening? Oh, we're gonna make it a day for them to remember by kicking their butt. Yes, butts will be sore when I am done. Woo! Throw my knives. 
Boom. I can use this one a little bit. It's not that good. If you could combo that downward with that spear attack right there, it'd be really good. Okay, I'm not taking any chances. We're just going to end them like this. Got the sword. Come here. Ah. Nice. I do have my awesome. I'm going to save it for a quick second. I'm going to let him respawn. Nice. I got a dumpling. But I do like Peacock in the movie. At first I was like, eh, Kung Fu Panda 2 is not as good as Kung Fu Panda 1. But after I watched it like five or six times, it like really grew on me and I really like it. I think it's good. It's not nearly as good as the first one in my opinion. But it is good. So let's see if we can eliminate... Ox before we bring in the special here or the awesome because he's already a really low percentage I hate to waste it on him when he's that low there we go nice now we're fighting just like a peacock using all our eyes we have tons of them of course if you guys know peacocks open up their feathers on the back and it looks like eyes his more specifically look red and black they're pretty cool he is actually a white pea fowl which is a peacock. Alright, let's bring our special and end the ox. Ox is just sitting there. See how this isn't that useful? <laughs> if the person's paying attention, they can kind of just avoid these. But it's cool, nonetheless. I mean, I like bringing in the firepower. And it's cool how we fly away. Alright, let's dodge him and knock him out. One more. Booyah. I don't think I did my downward attack at all, so I'll do that this next round here. And we're going in without any continues, so it's going to get risky. But that's okay. You got to risk it for the biscuit. Victory must be taken, and I will take mine. You better learn to duck. Your story does not have a happy ending. I hope you're more skilled than you look. Oh, Soothsayer, this is how we got into this mess. So there's my spin attack. Here's my taunt. You are pathetic. Here it is again. Here it is the third time. Yeah. Enjoy that taunt. All right, let's see if I can do something here to help my team. Who am I with? Mr. Ping. Nice, we should be good here. Yeah, I really like his smash attacks. Other than that, I don't think he's the greatest. He puts himself into some really sticky situations at times. He's not bad by any means, though. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about Lord Shen. Alright, we gotta stop Shifu from meditating. Knock him up. Totally missed. Punch him. Yeah! Stab him with the spear. I'm not sure what this weapon's called. Looks like a spear to me, but it's like a sword that's like rippled. It's crazy. It's cool. I like it. it must be like an ancient weapon. Because you don't see many people using that today. Like if you would go in versus an AK-47 with that thing, you would probably win because the sword is mightier than the gun. We prove that in Kung Fu Panda 2 when Poe defeats all the explosives. You can't deny that. All right, we're going to bring in the awesome. Nice. Get him. Booyah. Knock him out. Knock him out. One more. Yeah. <laughs> you don't control it at all. It's just amusing to watch. Wow. I'm in a predicament there. Oh, one other thing I forgot to show you guys. He can jump four times. One, two, three, four. He's got little wings. So that's a nice recovery tool. All right, moving on here. Real nice, real nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think we're good just as long as we don't have to fight the black and white warriors. Greetings. We meet at last. It's big time, big time. What? We're gonna fight? <laughs> okay then. Oh yeah, time to kill pandas. 
Everyone knows Lord Chen will do that with pleasure. Three on one, though. It's going to be a little bit more tough. Come on down, guys. All right, this isn't going too bad. There we go. Nice. Nice. Nice! That upward staff move is by far his best move. And I just had a sick recovery there. Woo! Stop crying, Panda! I will eliminate you! Oh! I will also pause the match for a quick freeze frame. I do have my awesome here. I will bring it in in a second. Nice. Yeah, his charge attacks are pretty solid. They all create distance. Because they're all really, really big whacks. Nothing better than whacking your opponent. The old whack stick. I believe that's the technical name for his weapon. The old whack stick. Boom! Coming in hot! Just like the one and only Peacock! Lord Shen. Because when that feathered fellow's in the room, you're gonna feel the boom. Sending you straight to your doom. Shen is also a triple platinum MC. Oh, what the what the what? Lord Shen. But enough rapping. More fighting. And quit whacking me with a fan, lady. I know you're a fan of Lord Shen. I mean, who isn't? But come on. Uh-oh. Not good. All right, we have our awesome. Oh, no, we lost it. How did we lose it? Do we lose it when we die? We might. I gotta pay attention. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Stinky old rabbit. No, oh, another one? Really? Uh-oh. I gotta be careful here. I have no dodges. Woo! Fighting kind of silly. Get that panda. Almost had my awesome. Nice. Give me a spin to win. I'll take this. Kind of an uneventful fight here, fellas. Sorry. Not fighting the best here. These guys really hit my number. Keep having to avoid this boar here who keeps charging up with the red beam. Woo! Doom was having awesome. Oh, I charged the wrong way there. Totally. That'll do it. That'll do it. That'll do it. That'll do it. No, that won't do it. You got Viper? I'm bringing in the cannons. Fire! 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 I like how she's trying to whack me over there. <laughs> Don't fight Cannonball, lady. You're gonna lose. Alright, I'm at zero. Boom. Come on down, fellas. Oh. Woo. One more spin. No. Oh! Can I come back in? I recovered. Holy cow. His recovery is pretty good. Like I was saying before. I think that's his best attribute. I'm gonna charge these up. Nice. Bringing down the wax stick. I think that's what we officially named it before. Boom! Coming up with those. Yeah, he's pretty good from uh, floor to floor to floor. I think that's his best fighting style, to go up and down. Try to get your opponents off balance like that. Booyah. Shen. Oh, excuse me, Lord Shen. With a victory. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. So, I was looking at his wiki beforehand because I wanted to see what kind of peacock he was. And apparently he died in the movie. You want to fight? 
As you wish. The early bird catches the, uh, let's fight! Oh, bird versus bird. Nice. Let's see which bird gets this worm. Yeah, so apparently he died in the movie. I don't remember him dying, though. I thought maybe he just, like, got knocked out. I didn't know he officially died. But, yeah, it says deceased in his wiki. Which is interesting. So we will never see Lord Shen again. This will probably be his last appearance. Well, maybe not. If they make a new fighter and stuff, he might come back. Fly, Peacock! Looks like Crane can fly just as well. See if we can eliminate him. Oh, wrong move. I'm so used to that being an uppercut. Come here, Crane. Nice. We avoided that. This map's pretty easy. You just let the other opponent make their mistake. Oh, <gasps> Mantis. <laughs> yes, Crane. Taste Mantis. Mantis is so good. Mantis changes the game. He's like that wild card. You never know what he's going to do. He's the guy, uh-oh, in the back of the van, cutting the brakes on everyone. The wild card, man. How about that recovery a second ago? That was something. Whoa. Uh oh. The rocks are falling on our heads. We might become dead. Those are the rocks falling on our heads. Nice song there. Get him. I like that move. <laughs> it's kind of funny. It's okay. I'm gonna poke you. I'm gonna poke you. Poke you a little bit. 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 bit. Alright, enough messing around with Crane. Time to eliminate him! And then roast him up into a nice bird feast. Shen's a cannibal. But a proud cannibal, nonetheless. Oh yeah, rocks and cannons. Avoid these, Crane. Avoid these. Booyah. Wow, he is actually avoiding those really well, actually. Wow. Impressive. Boom! Can't avoid that, though. Blade to the noggin. Oh, and of course I would fight Poe. This time, we're going to have a different result, and it will truly be the year of the peacock. No need for pleasantries. Let's fight. You've got nothing, because i got it all right here. All right, let's do this. Lord Shen versus Poe. Boom. I can spike you, panda. And throw knives. Come on down, come on down. Taunt him a little bit. I'm invincible! Okay. <laughs> Poe instantly proved that wrong. I'm invincible! Ah! Seriously, man, that hurts! Weren't you just listening? I'm invincible. Stop it. Alright, we got knives. Our knives are no good here, apparently. Oh, I thought I blocked that. Okay, our knives are truly not good here. There we go. Let's give him a downward spike. Come on. Boom! Uh-oh. Bam! Oh, yeah. It's like we're in a Batman show from way back in the day. With all these bams, booms, and kablows. Oh man, I'm the first to fall. Maybe it isn't the year of the peacock. I just need my faithful minions to come over here and bring my cannon. The one that breathes fire and spits metal. We can take out Poe easily. Come on down. Nice. Come on down. Nice. Come Oh, I don't, oh, did I really miss that? I got that second one, though. Boom! Uh-oh. I can bump bump, too. Alright. There we go! Real nice. Ooh, hammer. Oh, no! 
Okay, he didn't pick it up. Good. I don't want it. Give me the hammer. Hammer time! Hammer's really good, actually. Come on, Poe. I'm bringing my awesome. Weaken him a little bit. Here they come. That's one hit. Two hits. Three hits. Ah, ah, ah. Three cannonballs. And he's out. I love counting. Nice. There we go. Now we're doing work. Didn't avoid that though. Nice little counter step there. No! Oh, the hammer! Oh man, he's got his awesome. I gotta be really careful here. Did we get him? Booyah! Real nice. It is the year of the peacock. Or at least the day. Let's check out the ending. All will bow before the awesomeness of Lord Shen. Yes, bow, everyone. Or at least thumbs up the video. Otherwise, Lord Shen will blow you up. Yes, you will. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed. See ya. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you want more awesomeness, click on the video and subscribe to my co-op channel. Also, huge thanks to my supporters at Patreon. You guys not only help the channel, but me in so many ways, and I am extremely grateful. And if you want to become a fellow patron, check out the link in the description below. There are some pretty cool rewards, including getting your name in the credits here, and also being able to request a game. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.